This is a three phase sine wave inverter designed by MIDI. This is the full control PCB. These are the IGBT driver cards. This is the control module which will be assembled, programmed and supplied by MIDI. The specialty of this driver card is it can be mounted directly on the IGBT module itself. The peak current of the IGBT driver is 40 ampere, so you can use any high current IGBT. Hmm. Depending on the IGBT, you can change the gate resistance. Each module will sense individual IGBT current. If any short circuit or high current, this will trip so it is protected. Because it is mounted straight on the IGBT module, there is no wire length, which will create additional inductance in the driving circuit. This is a 4 line LCD display which will show all the parameters. The parameters displayed in the LCD are AC input voltage in each phase, AC output voltage in each phase, load in each phase, frequency etc. The major part of the control section is incorporated in the control module that is supplied by MIDI. The remaining components as you may see will not cost much which means the BOM of the inverter will be low and it is easy to assemble. The inverter has RS232 interface so you can monitor the parameters like AC input, AC output etc through a computer. The output of the inverter is connected to a three phase motor and the output is also connected to the oscilloscope. Now let us switch on the inverter for a demonstration of three phase motor load. The inverter is having a variable frequency drive. You can see in the oscilloscope the frequency is slowly increasing. At the same time motor speed is also increasing. Now the frequency has reached the normal 50 Hz and the motor speed has reached 1390 rpm. This is the rated motor speed. If you connect this motor directly to the main supply, the motor will run at this speed only. Now let us further increase the frequency for higher rpm. You can see the frequency is increasing and the RPM is also increasing. Now the motor speed has reached 3300 RPM.